holy and blessed Jesus Christ, the perfect radiance of the eternal Heavenly Father, who enlightens us with joy. As dusk draws in upon us and the evening lights appear, we sing our praise-filled hymns to God, the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Son of God, you deserve that every age joyfully sing your praise. For you give life. And so all the world gives to you its glory. As the day comes to an end, we say together, Search me, O God, and know my heart. Examine me and know my thoughts. See if there is any wicked way in me and lead me into the path everlasting. In the full confidence that those who seek the Lord God are assured of his peace, we say, may the peace of the Father be ours tonight. May the peace of the Son be ours tonight. May the peace of the Spirit be ours tonight. May the peace of all peace that flows from the Father through the Son and by the Holy Spirit be ours tonight and every night. Amen. Before we sleep, we desire again to hear from God in his word, and tonight, once more, we return to Psalm 71, and to verses 16 to 18, where the psalmist says, I will come and proclaim your mighty acts, Sovereign Lord. I will proclaim your righteous deeds, yours alone. Since my youth, God, you have taught me, and to this day I declare your marvellous deeds, even when I'm old and grey. Do not forsake me, my God, till I declare your power to the next generation, your mighty acts to all who are to come. A further privilege of a long journey heavenwards is the stories we can tell other younger and less experienced travellers. And what a privilege this is. Lord my God, thank you for the immense privilege of having known you so long. Help me to encourage others to find the delights of the pilgrim path. How precious are your thoughts, O God, how vast their sum, if I were to count them. They would outnumber the grains of sand on the seashore, and when I awake, I am still with you. Thus may the peace of all peace be ours tonight and every night, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.